DCU's annual charity event, Begborough Steel, is set to begin on March 29th. The event sees teams of two racing throughout Europe with no money, relying on only the kindness of strangers to aid them in reaching their final destination in Barcelona. The event has raised almost €100,000 for charity over three years. Dave Strogen, the event's operations manager, advised teams to stay positive. If you just kind of keep a smile on your face and, you know, keep your, keep your partner motivated as well, you know, you'll pull through and your energy will be infectious with the, the people around you. The event was delayed by a week to allow for extra fundraising time. However, Dave was confident that the sky's the limit for featured charity, Movember Ireland. It's, it's such a, a topical issue at the moment, you know, mental health and suicide prevention. It's, it's such a pressing problem with, you know, this demographic that would be in, in university here in DCU. So it, it's just something that I think it's close to everyone's hearts and everyone can kind of relate to us and, and see the benefit and the impact that, that it has. VP for Welfare and Equality, Podge Henry, said that the event helped students come out of their shell. On his second run of the event, a stranger on a plane initially refused to give his team and three others any money. However, after landing, the man bought London travel passes for the eight students, worth almost £300. We talked to someone who we didn't think was generous, um, but we just had to talk to him, and from that it was the most generous we got, most generous offer we got. Two DCU students that ran in jailbreak, a similar event, shared some tips for Beck Barrow Steel team. I wore a Supergirl costume. Which did attract quite did a bit attract of attraction. A lot of attention. A lot of attention. And Especially in Prague. Yeah, and Annie played the tin he whistle. Played the tin whistle, yeah. Clear head, have money yeah. to get home, um, because getting home is the most stressful part, actually. Well, Amy hasn't done it. This is her first time doing it, but um, myself, like I did it in 2016 to Berlin as well. And I also did it to Rome last year, so this would be like my third time. Three years in college, so I'm going for three in a row. And my advice is just don't care. Like, dress up as much as you can. Like, don't be afraid to go up to, like, different people. And just embarrass yourself, really. Like, because it's all for a good cause. It's good fun at the end of the day. So, you know, why, like, why not? If you, if you have any money, donate to both the charity or the teams. You know, whether, if you might know an uncle who's in a city the teams are stuck in. You know, keep involved, keep in touch. It's something, it's such such a great event. And even to watch from the, from the sidelines, it's always funny to see where everyone ends up. Daniel Troy, DCU TV News.